Hi friends, it's Emily here with today's Brain Break. Now I bet you're wondering, what is a Brain Break? Well, they're quick activities that help our minds refocus and so we can learn a little bit more about our bodies and feelings. So let's see what today's is. Today's Brain Break is all about learning how to relax different parts of our bodies. So I just want you to get comfortable. Maybe it's sitting like me cross-legged or lying on your bed, whatever works for you. The first place we're gonna try to relax are our hands and our arms. So I want you to use one hand and imagine that you're squeezing a lemon. Your whole arm should get tense and tight and you might be able to feel your muscle. So imagine you're squeezing all the juice out of it and then drop it on the floor. Wiggle your fingers, your arm should feel pretty loose, it might tingle, it should feel lots looser than when you were squeezing it. Let's try our other hand. Grab a lemon and squeeze it nice and hard and imagine all the juices from it. Again, your arm should get nice and tense and then drop it on the floor and wiggle those fingers. Do your arms and hands feel a little bit looser? The next place we can try to relax are our arms and our shoulders this time. Instead of lemons, we're gonna think that we're outside playing in the snow and we wanna build a snowman. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna push a big snowball to make the big bottom of our snowman. So we're gonna reach our arms all the way out in front of us and really push those arms and imagine you're pushing a big snowball. You should feel your arms get tight just like when we did the lemons and your shoulders should be tight too this time. So push as hard as you can. Now the next step of building a snowman is that we need to take this snowball to be able to put it on the top of our snowman. So imagine you're lifting a really big snowball right over our head and we're going to push it all as high as we can. Your back might feel taller, your arms are going all the way up. Whew, that was a lot of work. Do your arms feel lighter now? Another place we can relax is our neck and our shoulders. We're gonna do another animal this time. We're gonna think that we're a turtle, and turtles can go into their shells. So think that you're a turtle and that it's starting to rain, and we're gonna get into our shell by getting our shoulders up to our ears and trying to bring our ears down to our necks. So bring it all the way up as high as you can, hold it there, and release and drop them down. Let's do it one more time. All the way up and hold it as high as you can, and drop them, perfect. The last one we're gonna do is our face and our nose. This time we're gonna imagine there's a pesky little fly in the room and it lands right on our nose, but we can't use our hands to get it off. So we're gonna to have to move and wrinkle our nose as much as we can to get the fly off, just like this. I want you to make as many wrinkles in your nose as you can. You might have to close your eyes to get it off, just like this. Perfect and relax your face. Thanks for trying that brain break with me. It can be really helpful to learn how to relax different parts of our bodies in case we're feeling nervous, worried, or scared. Our body might get tense and it's really helpful to make it loose again. Not every brain break may work for you, but it's nice to try a bunch of different ones so you can build your own toolbox of ones that work just for you. Thanks for watching.